Hi, my name is Greg Paglia. I'm with West Roofing Systems, and welcome to another edition of Whiteboard Roofing. Today, I want to talk about the problems that the SRM system has. SRM stands for Silicone Restoration Membrane, and what it is is a fluid applied silicone coating that goes over top of the existing roofing system. Uh, most building owners are interested in learning more about this because it's more cost effective than a tear off. It can get you a new 10 or 15 year warranty, and it's environmentally friendly. So. With the white color, you can get more reflectivity with the sun, and with no to little tear off, it's more environmentally friendly that, that way as well. But with everything, there's always problems to it. And the first problem that the SRM system has is that it's pretty slippery, especially when it's wet. So if you have guys going up on the roof often or a lot of foot traffic, when it gets wet, it can be slippery. You know, anytime you're up on a roof, it's always a safety hazard, but um, just be aware when it's wet. The next thing is eligibility so not every roofing system can uh, get the SRM and really there's three ways that can, we can determine eligibility the first is if 25% of the underlying substrate and insulation is wet on your roof if it's like a big swimming pool it's not gonna be good but if it's in good working order it's gonna be okay next thing we look at is the seams so are the seams relatively intact and the last thing is if it's been maintained over its lifetime. So have you been involved with a roofing contractor for the lifetime of your roof? If you have, then you're good. If not, um, your roof might not be in a good order. And the last thing is that sometimes it can look dingy. So when we do the SRM, it looks white, just like this board here, but over time it's gonna collect leaves, dirt, algae. It's not gonna look as perfect and white as it is at the beginning. While it may change color a little bit, it's not gonna affect the performance of your roof. So just something to look at. And that's it for today. If you want to learn more, uh, the URL of the blog post is in the description. Hope you learned something new today. And thank you so much. Have a good day.